Hey guys, how are you? Happy Monday. So we are decorating some eggs to go in with orders. Thank you so much for all the orders. I was a little behind in the eggs because I hadn't really started decorating them yet, but here we are. And I plan to decorate more on TikTok. I think I'm gonna go live there maybe later today to decorate some eggs. Figure we could hang out with each other. These eggs are so much fun to do. Again, thank you, Carol, for sending these eggs to us. Um, they are plaster eggs, and they're giant. They're really nice size eggs. So this is the egg mazing machine that I use. I found it at Target during Easter time, and I did not utilize it for Easter at all. I have utilized it for making these eggs for fun to send home with the orders that are currently being placed. So I do apologize if you don't get one with your order. That means we ran out. But we will be looking for more of these eggs as long as you guys like them. If you don't like them, feel free to comment down below and tell me I am sorry. But I'm tired of getting free eggs with my orders. And we will not make them anymore. But anyways, in the meantime, we are having a lot of fun making them. Each one is always so much fun. They come out with different end designs. You even think that it might look one way, but in the end, it just ends up looking a different way. It's so cool. I prefer to just do the ribbon effect look, I call, versus doing solid colors, you know, for each section. I love the um, surprise design when I do it this way what I end up with the end results are always just so nice this is just my favorite way of doing this and then I use a permanent sharpie marker that's um, metallic silver and I write my name on there so yeah that's it that's my finished egg all right it is time to get this baby ready to go home this was the baby we did the last live birth with if you missed the birth from the womb make sure to check out the link in the description that video was so much fun i enjoy doing those videos so much so this is matilda she has already been adopted and for those asking we will have babies available soon i'm currently working on She's either going to be zero to three months or three to six months size baby. Um, she's a big baby, chunky, sleeping girl. Starling, I think, by A.K. Kitagawa is her name. Beautiful kit, so I'm working on that baby. And then we have an It's a Girl baby that's going to be available soon as well. So, yeah, just stay tuned to the website. Make sure to register with the website because when we have a new baby available... I send out an email. So we're going to be getting her ready to go home. She's going to go home in this nice, soft pink blanket. These are the items she was photographed in. I'll be sending home these stacking toys. This little elephant. So cute. Then these two diapers, which are super cute. They have like little babies or cher they're cherubs. They're little angels. Adorable. And then this really cute duck hat with these blue hand mittens. I thought that was so cute with her little white onesie that she's wearing underneath would be cute. And then these little socks. So let's go ahead and get her uh, into her box. Look at how cute she is. Oh my goodness. This baby is beautiful. I love the kit so much. Super, super cute. So congratulations, mommy. You're going to get a really cute baby. I think it also could take like a cut pacifier because it's got a pretty good opening to the mouth. So if you cut the nipple little piece, a little piece until it fits in there, I think it totally would work. But this baby has a magnet as well. So I put the diaper on the head for just extra protection to the art while traveling. There we go. And then we wrap her up. Oh my goodness. Goodbye, little girl. Goodbye. Get you all snug in there. And now we're going to put her in the box. Okay, got my tissue paper here. Let's see how we're going to do this. Put the tissue paper. Tissue paper. Tissue paper. And some tissue paper. All right, now we just need the baby. Here we go. In the box, like so. Then we have 
I got an extra piece of tissue paper. Let's put her diapers back there. We have her mitten with hat. Tuck that back there. These should fit. Oh yeah, they fit right there. Okay, that toy right there. Um, oh, her pink headband. I didn't put it on her. No. Now the stuff she was photographed in, she was photographed in that bib with that headband, these socks, these little hand mittens, this super cute dress, and her pacifier. Okay, so let's put her dress right there. Ooh, her box is pretty full. And then we'll leave her bib like that. There we go. Now we're coming to the door where I have some things to put in there. Pink bottle, little thing that says baby, and some confetti. Go. <laughs> oh my gosh. Congratulations. You have some confetti with your baby. Then over here, give her a pink llama and it's a girl rattle and a little slappy shark. There we go, oh my goodness, how fun is that gonna be? Now I just have to put the COAs in there and seal the box up. So here's her COA, there's only 500 of her. I need to get this kit for myself. And then her hand COA, so those will fit right in there. And then here is the egg. So we're just gonna put the egg right there. They're plaster, so they do fine traveling in the box. They're very heavy duty. We've actually thrown them on the ground and they don't crack open or anything. <laughs> we were seeing how heavy duty they were. We'll just put it right there inside the dress. Okay, so we are pretty much ready to seal this package up. Just make sure things fine. All right, there's the final look. I just realized that we haven't changed Edwin in some time. And do y'all remember the other day I was at Target and I was like, that outfit looks really familiar. Are they reselling it? <laughs> or am I confused? Or did they do something similar? Well, it's this outfit and I have it. I bought this last year, but I see it coming back out at Target this year. So it's Cat and Jack. Super cute. It's cream colored. But then, um, then it's uh, got navy blue trim on the neck the arms and the bottom of the onesie and then throughout the onesie it has sections where it's red orange yellow light blue dark blue a darker blue and then another blue it's really pretty and then it's got this like it's kind of it reminds me of the muslin blankets uh the overalls and they're knotted instead of like snapping together so we're gonna put that on him take off his dinosaur sleeper He's like, man, he just forgot about me. No, we didn't forget about you, Edwin. How could we forget about you? You're too cute to forget about. I just get caught up in other things. Right now, it's going to change rain, actually. And then I was like, oh my gosh, we should change um, Edwin. I'll change rain next. I do want to change her. So let's put that over there. And then, ooh, we're going to give him little sandals to wear. These sandals that were too small for Ocean, they fit him. So we're going to put on his little brown sandals. They're going to be so adorable, looking like he's going to the beach. Those who are not familiar with Edwin's kit, he is the Ellie Sue by Bonnie Brown. I painted this doll, I think, in 2018. I had this doll painted before the last doll show I went to, and I believe that was in 2018 when I went. So yeah, he's he was painted a while, and then when he came back to me as a gift from a friend to do whatever I wanted with, I decided I would keep him. Uh, I just like touched up his paint a little bit, you know, spruced it up to how I'm doing my painting now. I didn't really have to do too much, but it was just a little bit of work. And I love, I love his newborn look, young baby look. I really love that look. My goodness, look at you. 
This is so cute. Wow, this overall set fits you perfectly. He's also one baby that can do three month size clothing. So I like that as well. And then the newborn cat and Jack just fits him so perfect. He wears mostly newborn. His sleeper he was just wearing his newborn. But yeah, I was just saying that he can do some three month stuff too. So him and Ocean can share clothing. It's always nice to have a baby that can share clothing because sometimes I'm like, oh, Parker, I wish I had another baby because then I'd feel like I was getting more use out of my money than I could share it amongst your siblings. But I just have one your size. It's okay. He's spoiled that way. Look at how cute. These are koala baby shoes. Sandals. Oh my god. They're so adorable. Oh, we're going to have to do your photos, Edwin. <gasps> you are looking like a little ham today. Who is an Edwin fan? I love him. So cute. Oh my goodness. If you're an Edwin fan, comment down below. Tell us why you love him. Why are you an Edwin fan? Share with the world. <laughs> All right, guys. Well, I hope you're having a wonderful day. You're staying safe. You're not giving into those negative energies, also known as the communistic Karens. Just remember, they're not valid. Block them. Move on as if they never existed, and your life will be bliss. All right, guys. We love you so much, and we will be back soon. Bye.